paying attention. I, you know, catch him like falling asleep on the uh, yeah. stream setup. Because he works so hard, I'm gonna get over there and just move the camera. But here we go, Pokemon Stadium 2, game one. Adi versus Dill. I keep hearing Pokemon music that I don't recognize, and it's great because they're, 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 they're jams, man. They're jammers. I like 209. This is uh, definitely looking like a Smash 4 matchup here. We got Dill re repping Diddy and Adi repping yeah, Fox. This big is just shocker. Smash 4 HD, let me tell you what. Oh, uh, he caught his jump. Oh, uh, okay. Dill recognized that immediately. I'm, like, I'm, not, I'm not doing it. Yeah, not going to commit to that Went one. straight to the platform. And we got the good fox shots coming out from Adi. Trying nice to, snare. Trying to bait out uh, Dill's approach. Jab okay, going to send him off stage. Wow. That Dill is really relying on these air dodges to get through uh, pressure. Yeah. It might, might come back to bite him in the ass later on, but we'll yeah. see. I'm sure Adi has noticed. Let's go. I mean, I don't know what he's... You can actually... He had time to, like, charge an up smash really quick. <gasps> the actual banana peel spawn no. sealed Adi's fate. Good night. Oh, and now he's just looking for something. That... Trying to get the up air afterwards. Is that a thing? Still? He's trying. Oh, so good! The walk. People always run a roll because of how safe back air is on shield. The walk. Just walked up and covered the option. Man, does nice. it need a dash? Nice. Just waited. The rapid jab coming out. Grab still gonna give uh, Diddy some damage. Trying to get some follow ups with those up airs. Up tilt looks so awkward in this. <laughs> Single laser. Just add on that free damage. Might as well, you know? Yeah. So Dill tried to make it look like he was running away from all the pressure, and then he came back with a monkey flip. But apparently, uh, Adi was ready for it. Yeah, you. Has the up air he's, always he's ready? He's caught on with the, the air dodges. He was trying to fall down with that neutral, trying to bait out, like, because if Adi gets a sour hit in neutral, it probably still confirms into an up smash. Mm -hmm. It's, like, even better in this game. Ooh, he's trying to get the uh, Z drop up smash. Dill That's a DI just... mix up, right? Yeah. I mean, uh, he was definitely trying to get that uh, up smash out here ready. Nice spacing. Yeah, not going to fall for the mix up this time. Dill, SDing yet again. Third one. My man Dude, just, that sounds like it hurts. He tried to get him with the forward air footstool. I don't, I'm not sure that works in this game. Yeah, neither of them too shaken up by it. It pseudo works. You pseudo. can't footstool someone when they're in tumble, but if they act if they act out of tumble with a jump, you can footstool them at that point. But he just upbeat. It's all about, exactly. it's all about being patient. Down tilt into forward nice. air. Gonna get that to connect. Dill still one stock away. Taking up this first game, but he is taking on a lot of damage. He got that B reverse with the banana peel without uh, the momentum. And here we go. <laughs> that was Adi's plan. He okay, says these double jumps. Yeah, watching out for those falling nares. And Dill didn't really want to commit to that banana uh, toss, even though he like was added jumps, because he knows it's a bait that bodies just wants him to yeah. let go of his item. He'll probably stay under those platforms, just so Adi can't fall on him. Uh, but off stage, yeah. Nice. That was a just keeping stage. Option select. He spawned the banana peel to cover the right option, and his back air was covering the left option. Oh, uh. reads the tech wrong. Big punish? Oh, no punish. Yeah, I don't that think shield. <laughs> Looking super. He small. needed something to get out of there. Nice monkey flip. Just claws grabbing this time. Bit. He's been uh, monkey flip kicking. Dill is still in time. stage control and the lead. Oh up. wait. He's got him off stage. He's gonna chill backwards. Tries to go off. What was that? I think he tried to go for a trump, but uh, or maybe With just a, a neutral air off stage to just catch the rocket barrel boost if he was gonna recover a little bit away from the stage. Nice and but the nair. And Nair still takes it. And what was that? Fox. 
Up smash. I'm just gonna land right there. Ooh, dude, the shield pressure. So good. Sour spot, neutral air into up smash. Always North of 110. Yup. Still looking for the nair. No, we got Dill. The hitbox is bigger, right? For the up smash? It looks bigger. I, I think it is. It looks like, like the sweet spot is bigger. Dude, the back air is on shield. It's so good. Yeah, but it's very safe to just smack your opponent's shield real quick with your foot. Give yourself some spacing. Come back in, maybe get a grab follow-up. Bowser? Now, I know... Oh, that's that's Adi playing Bowser. Oh, yeah, you no said... Adi, really? Adi has a Bowser. Yeah. He's been picking up Bowser this game. For, some, for a second, I thought Dill was playing Bowser. I was like, what? Well, now he can't get jabbed, but it's not like Dill jabs. Yeah, so with Bowser, what offers to the table is definitely the tough guy effect. Allows you to be able to go through uh, softer hit moves. They just go right through them and they just ignore them completely as Bowser. There's yeah. a lot of super armor and a lot of his swings as well, a lot of his tilt smash attacks. Yeah, but this. how much how much does that matter in this matchup though? I mean, I honestly I've never seen the matchup in Ultimate yet, so I guess we're gonna see momentarily. Okay, oh, good so catch. Cool. Got some trades going on into the forward air as well. Nair's gonna get canceled by the banana peel. Yeah. Now in this game, uh, Bowser's neutral air is a kind of a great combo starter for himself. Allows yeah. him to try to get in there and get a follow back towards it. Goes for the jab. I think it does like 28% by itself or 22. It does a lot of damage. Oh, and up tilt stronger as well. Ooh, throws banana peel down. Goes yeah. for the down throw for the damage and spacing because up throw up air is yeah. not really a thing anymore. No longer Bowser. the grappler he was. No. <laughs> <laughs> just going to move him? Yeah. He thought he was going to do a normal getup. Or oh, wow, if, you, if you dash at your opponent like that, it covers both neutral getup and roll to the right. So that's why you'll yeah. see a lot of players do that. But getup attack, unless he was going to push shield. Yeah, you know, he reacted too late. Mm -hmm. yeah, you you're you're, you're going to see that a lot from Bowser, though. Run up, short hop fair. Very similar to Charizard's gameplay. Yeah, it's, both of them shield poke really easily. He's going for a big read with that down smash. Dill's just going to capitalize on that all day. Waits for the roll. Off stage. And this is the problem with like heavyweights versus Diddy Kong, right? Is that they just have so much trouble trying to outmaneuver this little chip hand thing. Yeah. Can't find his way out of there unless he just lands a hit. Nice. Parry. Not going to get him anything. Oh, he had the right idea. I don't think he meant to full hop there. Oh, Ooh, that footstool. No, okay. Not enough to get the kill just yet. Yeah. Up tilts at a shield. Really good. Has way more range this time around as well as a good knockback. I love how quick this big thing is. Yeah, Bowser's really quick, and the, the new update where you can like tilt out of dash exemplifies his dash a lot more. They move over the back air, but Bowser is the heaviest character in the game. He's gonna yeah. be living for a while. For another like 30% before Dill uh, is looking to take it with like a. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna do it. Down tilt the back air, but that damage is slowly starting to creep upwards. Nice. Cannot find his way back to the stage. Dill is dominating the control. Finally gets one more back here, and Adi's stock has been eliminated. Neutral air. Nair's out. I thought he was going to chase him with Nair's, but yeah, Adi was Dill uh, too smart to try to land on on a swinging bounce. Yeah, there was no way he was going to go for that air dodge that Adi was definitely looking for. Back throw has him off stage. Tries Ooh, okay. to go for a down air. Catch my man Hit him coke. with like the, the landing hitbox. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, bad situation. Oh, Dude, if he got that bear, that might have been The him. monkey flip challenging the back air. Yeah, it came out first. Ooh, does the parry into grab. He's getting these parries, the yeah, but he's, he's not getting anything from them. Yeah, he's uh, just not recognizing where his opponent's going to land. After you hear, you know, you just hear the sound effects, you just go for a quick move. Yeah. He's getting them. <laughs> the well, oh, power shields on uh, projectiles, the parry. Are Earlier, by the way, uh, creative recovery from Dill. Get back to the stage. Like sometimes you just can't get anything off of a parry, and that's okay because you're saving your shield because you're dead. Yeah. Yeah, he's never bad. Yeah. Audi coming down with that neutral a little bit too soon. Dill still had iframes from the spawn back spawn in. Now things are looking pretty bleak for Audi. Dill just needs one banana toss or down tilt into a confirm. Bowser doesn't need too many. Uh, he doesn't need to get in too many times. Just get the forward air follow back Actually, towards. Actually, air dodge Yeah, he had a little bit too much rage. He's not too scared, but scared enough. If Adi ca gets, catches wise That's today. exactly what he was baiting. That's exactly what he was baiting, the aerial approach.
The thing is, eventually, Audi was going to have to, you know, make a move. Because he was technically losing, and Dill is no stranger to just, like, not playing the timer, but just not approaching and just continually doing, like, I'm the, not saying the Dill dials. couldn't have reacted to anything else, but that was what he was planning on. Like, you're going to approach from the air because I'm making it a pain on the ground. Hook, line, and sinker. And... Again, not saying Dill couldn't react to, like, say, you know, uh, he tries to hop behind him or whatever. But, like, that was exactly what Dill was expecting. Why did he switch in the first place? I guess maybe you see his Fox was a uh, main chance getting a little bit too aggressive, too, uh, too carried away. And Dill was, like, adapting too, too fast. But he's going back to Fox. Yeah. Maybe this time around it'll feel a little bit better. Another thing is he maybe could try to, like, uh, quote out gimmick his opponent unquote with a brand new character he has doesn't have time to adapt to but Dill definitely knows how to fight against yeah. heavyweights. Uh, maybe he just wanted to see like what would happen with you know being a, a game ahead. Nice. Just gonna lead into a grab. Now we are going to town and city. Chips on the banana peel. Wow. Tries to get that up smash. I want to hear the forward throw again. Nice. Gets the banana peel into a Fox Illusion combo. Yeah, I don't think Dill is playing yet that, like, his opponent knows how to handle his banana. Just because it's a different game doesn't mean uh, Adi is any less knowledgeable with what to do. Right above that uh, F smash. Fixing him up. Opposite recover down from really behind. Really was a really good situation for Adi, but he's going to get grabbed. Still rolling in between him. Two a rare miss tech from Adi. Yeah, oh, that was the second jump too, right? Yep, opposite. Nice. Just go for the rocket barrel. Still really seven. good uh, horizontal recovery from Diddy. No capitalization from Adi either. <gasps> oh, that was an up smash. That had to be. It was sick. Yeah. It was thinking about it. Something that I think is catching a lot of people off is that you can't jump cancel anymore. Yeah. So yeah, you can't. So you just do run up, jump A, and yeah. then there's your forward air, and you're like... <sighs> <laughs> nice. He's, he's still going for what he needs, but he's trying to go about it a different way. And that's going to uh, tie the stocks up. Yeah, I'm gonna. Okay. <laughs> that banana was definitely important. So, what's up with banana? Like, when does it actually go away? Is it just timed? Oh, here we go. He's getting back onto the stage. He's got 129%. Turn out the neutral airs. Good, just jumps right behind him. Wants to get the grab instead. Back air back. Ooh. Gonna catch the side B. Yeah, good catch. All right, going with the dash tag. Nice. Back air conversion. Wait, gets the monkey flip right onto him. Dash attack. Dash attack actually leads into fair. Like, it's true. Up smash, catching the air dodge right through him. Nice back up. But Dill ready for it. DI makes up again. Gonna get him the forward air. That was a free punish from Dill. Could have easily gone for a grab. Still not used to it stopping on shield. Yeah, definitely was thinking that Fox was just gonna go right Yeah, right him. behind him. Yep. Too used to it. Try to go for the shield grab. Wow, covers his, his landing with a, a jab of all things. Yep. Oh, so if it trades with something, or if it clashes with something, it still goes through. It doesn't stop. That's wow. <laughs> Just jump back here. Bankai shaking his head at that. Dill takes away game number three. Starting off with a 2-1 lead. Bankai's got to get something going. I think that's why he wanted to switch off a of Fox from game yeah, one. Yeah, he saw something in that first game. Yeah, even though he... Technically won the game. He knew the adaptation was coming, so he just wanted to mix him up. So we're going to see if anything new comes out from Bankai. If he's going to stick with the Fox. 
Or this could be it. I feel like we're not really playing Fox in this. Like in this set, it's been Diddy. Wait, what do you mean? Like, like Fox is supposed to be oppressive, and he's not. He's not been able to play Fox. He's been definitely having some hard times trying to and find while, his opening. Yeah, and while Dill hasn't been dominating, he's been playing his game. He's honestly looking for that forward tilt. Dude, I love his down throw. He really chucks people. Yeah, they go up flying up there. The they go flying horizontally hard, or vertically, I mean. Hey, Dill's, you notice that Dill's kind of chilling on that platform. Yeah, I already noticed too, and just <laughs> went up there to meet him. It's like, whatever, man, I'm gonna go up there and get this grab. Okay, I'm gonna get him off. Monkey flip follow up. He fared him, convinced him that shield was the better option, and then grabbed him. It was a, a really good sequence. He's gonna reflect that heal right back at the fox. Off stage. Uh, or not. Wow, he's trapped. Like a rat. Monkey flips raw right into his face. Almost got the kill to boot. Dude, is Fox all right? Uh, he needs some help, dude. We got we got to call an ambulance for him. We need to get the get the stretcher from Town City. Can we check Stat. his eyes? Ooh, up tilt. Gonna be able That's to be up there and follow up. Okay. Dill to recover off stage. No. He is completely okay. vulnerable. Free down smash for Roddy. Not sure what compelled Dill to let go of that ledge and maybe it was a misinput. Had to be. With the air dodge and everything? Yeah. Had to be. But, you know, Adi's not too upset about it. They can be able to get the close out that stock for free. And now Adi is getting a chance at this fight again. Town City's going to back him up. Got the new state layout coming out from town. Bringing him back to the OG. With the three blocks. to throw it off stage. Rapid jab against the shield. Oh, good response from Dill. He's jumping above it. Yeah. That's what you have to do sometimes. Some people will just hold it. I like what Adi was doing earlier with the Nairs uh, to just call out Dill's jumps. He was doing that a lot in game one, and I think he did it oh, only a little so far in this game and the game before. I think he should rely on Nair a bit more, just as an anti-air. Oh, the platform game started starting to get stretched off a bit. Oh, yes. Kick him right back off. Trump, this is going to be... Oh, uh, that was an opportunity for Adi. Last time he re-grabbed, uh, so he thought he was going higher this time. Yeah, Adi was definitely waiting for Dill to go for a rocket barrel boost onto the stage. Which is why he didn't want to like commit to the down smash. There we go, monkey flip kick. Banana nice. peel allows him to get the back here. He got caught by the Firefox, though, and we gave up stage control. Narrowly avoiding that forward smash. Alexander the fly in, spawns an ampule to give Adi himself some breathing. Adi playing this one a lot better. Mm -hmm. oh, he had the idea. So looking for that up smash. Gets the footstool. No. Oh, he wanted the down wow. air and just throws his stock away. What a reverse. What a, what a, what a, what a homie. Just, didn't even need that stock. That's right, the Dil? second time Dill has given him a free stock in this game. That is probably the fifth time I've seen Dill die needlessly today. Here we go. One stock apiece. Dill one game away. One stock away from moving on to loser's quarters. Can he pull this off? Adi chasing him without bears. Ooh. Puts him right on the plat where he wants him but gets hit by the get up attack. Yeah, that was a good that was a good response coming out from Dill. Didn't caught Adi a little bit off guard. Because Adi's definitely looking for like sort of rolls. Good parry to just help him escape the situation. Yeah. Try to do more with it, but. Gets him out of disadvantage, so that's good too. Yeah, it's the forward the throw. Now Adi is looking for this sour hit neutral air. Potentially leading to an up smash. Dill hyper aware of it. Goes up, gets the grab, tries to rack on some damage in the process. Yeah, there has been more Fox happening this game. Oh, that could have been big. He was reading the other way. Yeah. If he would have just air dodged in a little bit more. Really smart option by Dill. Again, good catch from Adi. Reading Back it. Oh! The banana peel killing. We got snipes. And we have a taunt to boo. Bunkai feeling himself. This could be the start of some momentum. For the game five. And hopefully he can carry it into the final game. The walk again. Yep. That's how you know Adi's playing on fire is when he's just walking. Because he knows, like, you're going to you're gonna do something stupid. going to roll. <laughs> I got up smash with your name on it. Here we go. Game five. 
still thinking considering Yoshi's Island Brawl. Potentially could be a good stage, a fine stage for him. Allows that platform to cover a lot of the stage so he can easily, like, you know, yeah. gra that, that grab his peel. Scary. Yeah, he can grab his peel on the platforms, like, pretty much from wherever he is. Like a Diddy at center stage yeah. on Yoshi's Island? That sounds really But scary. might just go for the comfort pick instead. Pokemon Stadium 2 coming back at you live. Game 5. Potential counter pick? No, my man's going to play Diddy. He's hovering. Okay. I know he likes King K. Rule, but no, not, not, not right now. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Which one was hovering? Uh, no, uh, just one, Dill has a King go. K. Rule, a pocket. I've never seen him bust out in a tournament before. He's a troll character. It was one of the first characters he played. He really enjoyed him. Chucks it off stage. Did it. Dill did exactly what Audi wanted. Pull out another banana, mm. and I'm going to punish you. Simple. Okay, Audi is going to ham, actually. Covering a little bit too yeah. deep. Okay, this is the confidence now coming out from Odyssey, as you can see him starting to move. 30%. Off of Rocket Barrel Boost, my god. Down air? Ooh. Okay. A little bit too high a percent. Great DI coming from Audi, avoiding that by holding left. Yeah, he wasn't gonna <laughs> just put his controller. Nice. Oh, good spacing coming out from Dill, avoiding the shield grab. Off stage again. Let's get that peel out of here. We are schmixing right now. Audi. That bear does not send as horizontal as it used to. Neutraler just throws out the sex okay, kick. Okay, just going to take the banana peel first and then recover after. And Dill had the monkey flip there because if you had to grab the ledge, completely vulnerable. Sour yeah. hit, not in top smash, just goes for the grab yeah, Audi instead. is following him. Goes for the banana peel instead of the... Oh, he's making Dill... Gets the stock anyway. He's making Dill feel like he, there's no correct option for him. The like, oppressive fox. Yeah. Okay, avoids the grab. Oh, a little bit too soon. Thought he was going to let it let go of it a little sooner. Oh. Okay, good Audi going for the double jump instead of forcing a tech situation. He tried to make it look like he was going to go for a banana peel and then he put a fair between them. Good mind games coming out from Dill. Back air. Oh, rocket barrel boost. Him again, going for these short hop neutral airs. Yeah, it seems like whenever he, he's lost his jump and he's still getting hit, he'll just air dodge into the ground or the platform. Uh, Dill's gonna be looking for these down tilts to get some confirms. Oh, fair. Down tilts. Both of them playing uh, a lot faster. This game five. Dancing on the shield, Dill's not budging. Good old Tomahawk. Banana peel finally back out. Grabbed it through his shield? What? I was gonna say that's probably going off stage, but the dash attack just wasn't spaced. And we have that forward air to cash that monkey flip. Dill coming back in, throwing out all these back airs, forward tilt to push him off. For the oh. Punish? Oh, a little, a little slow on the upkeep. Yeah, and like it's not, not as much of a thing in this game. Nice. Off stage again. Yeah, yeah gonna Dill actually going to hit him away first. Yeah, that seems to be Dill's game him. plan in this game, right? Just keep Audi away so it gives him time to grab his tool that he needs, the banana peel. Yeah. His entire neutral relies on that. I, I, I appreciate this could be a bad spot for Dill. I don't think Audi's going off stage. Yeah. Doesn't want to risk it. Not at all. Not with his lead. That, that was his jump to another SD. Self-destructing like crazy. He needs a he needs a sour nair. Which goes for the raw up smash instead. Audi trying to send home a Made message. it look like he was going for a grab and then went for the up smash, but Dill not biting. Saying I'd rather get grabbed than anything else. If orders in case with the retreat, yeah, now got the, a little antsy. Banana peels back out. Dill, I feel like, has stolen this game. The second Audi SD. Yeah. It is just like he lost all the momentum they had going, and Dill is capitalizing. He is out of jumps. Potential spike. Why oh, did he give it to the down yeah, air? He had right? to throw away. I could have. He rolled in again. But Audi, because of, because of the now, disadvantage. Because Dill didn't want to commit to the down air, Audi could potentially bring this back. Dude, we got Vortexes. Down tilt. Wants to get him set up. He needs to pop him up. Oh, he tried. Yeah, the, the pinky toe narrowly missing his hat. It's the jab. Okay. Pushes him off stage. 
No way he really he really willingly put himself above Fox. And Bonkai. And now he's back to the side. Oh. Playing so smooth. Oh, the shine spike. Rocket he oh. can't get back to stage. That shine. is it. Bonkai coming out here. Odyssey. Adi. Adi, what did I say? Bonkai? My bad. I meant Adi. They're both wearing oh the same shirt. Oh, my God. Odyssey. Wow. That was all that was a hundred percent Dill's fault.